the black ghost knife fish known scientifically as Apteronotus albifrens gets its name from two things. Its deep black coloration and the legend among native tribes that the spirits of the departed reside in these fish. This mythic origin only adds to the mystique of a species already shrouded in grace and silence. With no dorsal or caudal fins its movement is powered by an undulating ribbon-like ventral fin that allows it to swim forward backward and even hover as if it were flying underwater. What sets the knife fish apart is not just its beauty but its electroreception. It generates a weak electric field through specialized organs along its body and uses this field to navigate murky waters detect prey and communicate with others. It's one of the few species on earth that literally sees with electricity. In dark river bottoms and dense vegetation this electric sense becomes its primary form of awareness. Despite its ghostly aura the black ghost knife fish is a skilled and effective predator. It hunts mostly at night preying on insect larvae small crustaceans and worms. Its mouth is located underneath its body perfect for skimming the substrate and its lateral motion gives it the advantage of a stealthy approach. It prefers calm slow-moving waters with lots of cover and caves to hide in during daylight hours. One fascinating aspect of its behavior is how it uses electric pulses not just to sense the environment but to communicate. Different frequencies and rhythms of its electric organ discharges EODs are like underwater morse code used to establish territory attract mates or avoid confrontations. In aquariums some knife fish even alter their electric signals to adapt to others nearby. Their social behavior is a mix of curiosity and solitude. Young knife fish may coexist in small groups but adults tend to be territorial and prefer having their own space. They are known for recognizing familiar environments and even becoming somewhat accustomed to humans who feed them regularly. Some aquarists report that their knife fish come to the surface to eat from their hands. As for appearance this fish is a true stunner. It's jet black often with a white stripe running from its nose to the dorsal area and white markings on its tail fin tips. Its long flowing form can reach up to 20 inches 50 centimeters in length in the wild though most aquarium specimens remain smaller due to tank constraints. Reproduction in captivity is rare and challenging. In the wild mating likely involves coordinated electric communication and spawning in concealed spaces. The species shows slight sexual dimorphism with males often exhibiting higher frequency electric discharges than females but it's difficult to sex them without special equipment. Despite its alien appearance the black ghost knife fish is highly sensitive. It requires clean well oxygenated water and does not tolerate stress well.